Hello and welcome gamers. I am John, host of Video Games in the World, and today I got some news for you. It's been announced that Call of Duty Black Ops is having a remake, and it's called Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So, for 17 long years, Call of Duty has been a defining first-person shooter video game series for a very long time now. I remember playing my first Call of Duty game, which was 2 on the 360. Then I played Modern Warfare on that same console, and I own the entire mo old Modern Warfare trilogy, and I played the original Black Ops, Black Ops 2, 3, never played 4, Ghosts, I didn't like it. 3, never played. Hey. But still, Call of Duty is one of the most loved first-person shooter games of all time. So right, so I said before, the next Call of Duty game is officially titled Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. So this is a, another Call of Duty game that will take place during the 20th century. The conflict between the United States and the Soviet Union. So Call of Duty posted an enlisted trailer that showed up gameplay but shows real video footage from the Cold Era of history and also using the voiceover of KGB defector Yuri Besmenov as he explains the tools of fighting a cold war and the trailer can be watched. So the title reveal is Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. It's being developed by both Treyarch and Raven. Now Treyarch was responsible for developing the first Call of Duty Black Ops game as well as World at War for the PS3 and also Black Ops 2, 3, and 4. Now, I really loved the first Black Ops, but 2 was okay, but 3 and 4, not my cup of tea, because I didn't like that they that they jumped from the Cold War all the way to the future. So, Activision has only recently started teasing a new Call of Duty game, despite repeatedly assuring the community that a new shooter was going to be released this year. So, Activision began sending out mysterious slideshow projectors that led community on an alternate reality game that eventually uncovered a mysterious website that played news clips from the 60s. So, as you can see, the next Call of Duty game is going to be back to the Cold War. So, so we're going to see like like some espionage and probably we will see remakes of um the main hero of the original Black Ops, Alex Mason. Yeah, we all remember that Alex Mason was played by Sam Worthington, the actor known for his role as Jake Sully in Avatar, as uh, Perseus in Clash of the Titans as well. well he, 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 he's a pretty good actor, um, Sam Worthington. So, I'm disappointed that this teaser trailer had no gameplay footage whatsoever, but... Hopefully we can see Alex Mason once again in, in this game. He has to be. It's Black Ops, right? And then his son takes the lead in Black Ops 2, David Mason. Hopefully we can see not only espionage during conflicts between the US and the USSR, but also we can see like a uh, Vietnam or something like that, you know? But what do you think, people? Yay or nay for Black Ops Cold War? Do you think it will succeed or will it fail? Let's hope it succeeds. So, comment, share, rate, and subscribe. This is John of Video Games in the World. Peace. And also, this September, my Season 1 reboot is coming. And for my Season 1 reboot, I'm gonna add episodes that I thought of doing but never made it to season one so season one is a reboot of video games in the world the season one reboot more extended and better than ever i'm john of video games in the world peace and get ready to for battle in black ops later